to show you a quick little modification you can do with your Venom Pro 2 charger. This is going to be taking out the fan because the fan is a very common thing to break on this charger unfortunately. It's a great charger but I'm just going to be removing the fan because it's really loud and let's get it over with. The only thing you're going to need for this is a uh, more on the small side Phillips screwdriver. The first thing we're going to do I flip it over. I'm going to take out the five screws on the back located here, 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 and here. Now we're going to carefully pull off the back and bring all the screws with it. Don't lose any of these screws. It's okay if you lose them, but it's better for it to be proper. We want to focus on the red side, so we're going to set that to the side, don't pull on this wire too much, and we're going to move three screws, one here, the other here, and last one here. As you can see, this fan has wire that leads up to the circuit board, and you can just unplug that wire. And now, you've disconnected the cooling fan. You could just remove it right now as it is. Just pry this back and then take it off and then throw it out. However, you can take this wire, buy a new fan, and then um, put it back on, connect everything back together, and maybe that fan you are going to buy will work correctly with this. But either way, I know for a fact that this one just doesn't work. It's It's extremely loud for a cooling fan. So yeah, I'm going to be considering this junk. I might get a new cooling fan in the future. But yeah, you could just put everything back together as you took it apart. And that is it for this demonstration. I'll talk to you later.